Hello Internet, Mark here again with another video from United Language Center. Today we're going to talk about a couple different phrases, a couple different words we use in English. This first one, you see the word some? Right? We have this word, we have someone, somebody, something, somewhere. These we use in positive sentences. Right? When maybe we don't want to say the person, I saw Matt, right? You remember the other teacher who does the videos for the channel, right? I saw Matt. If we know the person, we can do the name. But maybe I see someone. Uh, I see a person. I don't know who they are, right? You could say, oh, I saw someone. I saw somebody, right? Both of these, the someone, the somebody, these ones we use for people, okay? For people, someone, somebody. If I say, I saw something, I bet you can guess this one. If I say something, ah, right? They give you the answer in the word, right? Saw something, that's for a thing. And then last one, if you say, oh, I went somewhere. I went to Marina Bay. I went to uh, Bugis. I went to Singapore. Those are the places, right? So if you say, I went somewhere, right? That's, in re in, that's instead of using the place, right? I went somewhere, okay? If you want to use a negative sentence, negative sentences are right here, like the didn't, right? You can say, oh yeah, I didn't see. Oh, see, same as the beginning, right? The one, the buddy, someone, somebody, people. If I go down here, anyone, anybody, also for the people, right? But this, again, our negative. I saw someone. I didn't see anyone. I saw somebody. I didn't see anybody. Right? Same for, right? Same for our thing. I saw something. I didn't see anything. I went somewhere. I didn't go anywhere. Right? Positive to negative, you have to change. Same for the question. Question, you'll see this pattern, right? Did you see? Did you go? For the questions, you also have to use our any. Anybody, anyone, anything, anywhere for our questions. Now, if I ask you these questions, I can say, oh yeah, did you see anyone at the shopping center? Did you see anybody uh, on the way to work? You're like, no, no people, <laughs> no, no one, right? You can use a short answer, right? Did you see any, did you see anyone? No, nope, no one, right? Or did you see anything? See anything? Mm, no, nope, nothing. Short answer. Finally, did you go anywhere? Sometimes for the weekend, uh, whenever I'm at home on Saturday, Sunday, maybe I, could say, I can say, did you go anywhere on Sunday? You're like, nope, nowhere. I stayed at home. Did you go? No, nowhere, no place. These are the three additional words right here our no one, right? If we see no one, oh, remember, someone, anyone. This short answer, we can say no people. We can say no one. Same thing, something, anything. Here, no thing, right? But we say nothing. And last, right, our where, nowhere, no place, no, nowhere. Okay, finally, these three can also be used up here again in the positive. We can say, I saw no one. I saw nothing. I went nowhere over the weekend. I went nowhere on Sunday. Okay, so I hope you guys uh, can get this basic pattern. If you're from my class, uh, please review these. These are important. You have to keep, right, keep the green in the green. Keep any for the negatives and questions. So if you can, you can try to write some of these below. Be like, oh yeah, I saw someone yesterday who had blue hair. I don't know. I saw uh, something yesterday. I didn't go anywhere yesterday, right? Try to think of your own sentence using some of these words, all right? And we'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.